Please consider liking the video. Please consider subscribing. Shut up and sit down. Oh, hello and welcome to enough well side by side video. I've had a subscriber reach out and he's having problems with his interior lights. Now, the interior lights, you can turn them on or off with the buttons next to the light. And then they should also come on when you open the door, as I've just done here. Stay on for a little bit and go out. But you can disarm that particular function. You can stop them coming on. And this gentleman has said to me, his lights don't come on when he opens the door. Let's just let these time out. And then I'll push the button here that says door. So if I push that button and it sort of pops out a little bit. Now when I open the door, the lights don't come on. If I re-push that button, the lights will come back on. Now, if your lights don't come on at all like that, there's a good possibility the little bulbs may have gone. But if your lights come on when you push the button, but then don't work on the door switch, there's a possibility there's either a fault with this unit, or you've got a faulty door switch. And what I would suggest, if your lights don't come on with the driver's door, try all the other doors. Open every door, see if the lights come on with any of the other doors. If they don't, there's a possibility that's faulty. So I'd go to Toyota and ask them to check it out. Because as far as I'm concerned, that is a warranty problem if that interior light doesn't come on with the doors. Because that incorporates quite... A few functions it incorporates the lights and it also has the emergency button to call for help in the event of an accident the car will automatically call for help if it thinks the um, incident has been severe enough but you've also got the option of that so that's quite a, an important part of the car. So, so the gentleman who reached out to me, try what I've just done. Try the button in both positions. Try all the doors. If it still doesn't work, I'd, I'd advise going back to your Toyota dealer, showing them the problem and letting them have a look at the car. And now, once again, Please consider liking the video, please consider subscribing.